back to another episode of Shogun Studios. I'm back with my other two hosts, uh, Cassius and so, uh, CJ. All right. Um, before we started, I'm going to do a little housekeeping. Um, we got our Twitter, Studio Struggle, our Instagram, Struggle Studio underscore. Um, we also have a YouTube for the gaming and a YouTube for a podcast. Our uh, was the Struggle Studio Gaming and Struggle Studio just on YouTube. Um, we're on all streaming platforms, Spotify, Apple Podcasts, you name it, you know. So make sure you rate us, rate us five stars. And let's get into it, y'all. Know. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Uh, first of all, we're going to start off with this. It's, it's been about a year, you know. It, yeah. A little more than a year for us. Um, whole lot of red, all right. I feel like we all had uh, our very strong opinions about it. I don't know about you, CJ, because you were really, really like, in touch back then, mm-hmm. all right. Uh, CJ is a little newborn when it comes to music. <coughs> uh, if I remember correctly, I think we called it a whole lot of ass. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're originally known as Whole Lot of Ass. <laughs> yeah. uh, a year ago from Christmas, uh, Playboy Cardi dropped his highly anticipated album, Whole Lot of Red, all right? Mm-hmm. Um, when it first came out, I think on trending, the first thing, the minimal thing on trending um, on Twitter was trash, all right? <laughs> Garbage. <laughs> so I feel like now the whole internet's kind of flopped, okay? A while where the fake fans, dick writers, are stands. Mm-hmm. Um, are overpowering the real the real like truth of the what the album was. Mm-hmm. Um, now I feel like everyone's like saying like okay it was a great album all time like mm-hmm. this is a great album. Um, originally I feel like niggas was shitting on it. Mm-hmm. So I, now we're, I don't see how you feel back like, um, a year later. I still think it's a hard ass. Ain't gonna lie. Um, I will say though, I, I at first I had no a lot of it, but now I got like maybe one or two off of it that I I can tolerate. What songs? Um, you know. I don't know the name of it. I don't know the name of one. Stop breathing. I'll stop breathing. <laughs> <laughs> but other than that... Stop breathing me is a troll song, bro. Like, I can't do this series. Yeah, but... It, it, like, <laughs> like, I would never seriously put that song on, like, for, like, a... Like, someone put, like, a Drake song, and, yeah. like, okay, what's your best song for this? And I put that on, I would never do that, you know? Yeah, it, it, that's, uh, that's almost like I, can, I think I tolerate. Um, I will say, though, seeing him, like, perform the songs, they sound better. Yeah. In the stadium, you know, when niggas who like the song actually sing with them and stuff like that, but like, definitely, it's not well, better. Right, I feel like every song, yeah, that's true. Cause like, whether whether you like it or not, I feel like it's not. It's not. I don't call it seat mentality, mm-hmm. but mm, like, I, like whether you like it or not, like I feel like everyone has like a little bit of like follower mentality. Yeah, right? oh yeah, like, when, like like when you see somebody do somebody and everybody enjoying this shit, you kind of want to, you kind of yeah, you want to be a part of it too. Like like, yeah. so whether you like, it, it could be like freaking Corlerae, you know, yeah. like. Everybody vibing at the at the, at the um, fucking stadium. Yeah, you gonna want to vibe too, you know. Yeah. So like, I, I feel like we come to Cardi music. Um, CJ, are you a Purple Cardi fan? Uh, what? I don't think I call myself a fan. Get <laughs> my fucking Cardi fan. Cardi. I can't call myself a Purple Cardi fan since I only listen to like one song. Let's stop breathing. <laughs> what, like that recent? Yeah, pretty recent. Uh, for me, uh, I feel like my opinion changed on it a little bit, a little bit. I feel like it grew me just a little bit more than it did on from last Christmas. All right, mm-hmm. um, a year ago, I was calling the trash. Today, I'm gonna say it's it's, it's like a boo boo. Okay, yeah. Maybe you had to drop it on Christmas either. You can, yeah, if you drop it on Christmas, yeah, you better. <laughs> it will be fire. Can I get my gifts? And then you gonna drop an album on Christmas too? Come on now. And okay, for me, I think um, I, 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 <laughs> I, the songs that grow me, um, Sky, um, yeah, I, I've been in love. Uh, stop, stop breathing, bro. That, that shit's always fun to me, bro. <laughs> Take your shirt off and then it hold. Stop breathing. <laughs> um, what a song. It's called something about something something about, something about dying, bro. I feel like I think feel like feel like dying something. Like that. Um, that song's good. But then it's, it's still like the same trash songs to me, like like mm-hmm. some songs that are just are unredeemable. Mm-hmm. Like um, I fucking hate New Tank. I don't like um, I don't like Vampire Anthem or Vamp Anthem. Um, <laughs> it, it's a it's a lot of like Metamorphosis. Um, what's the song Future? Oh, what's the song called? Teenets. Oh, but it's it's a lot of like to me it's a lot of just dookie songs that are like like it's, it's I, like some it's songs that I don't never see growing on me. You yeah. know. Um. But yeah, a year, a year later, a year ago, whatever, or, or that's not, I think so, ass. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie, I'm ass, bro. Um, well, speaking of, like, the, the yearly stuff, um, with, 
We dumb as hell, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> we thought uh, last week was last week of... Um... I, I didn't blame for that. I didn't blame for that. I didn't yeah. for that. I took the calendar. <laughs> oh, yeah. Next, next week will be New Year. So, uh, technically, this... This is last week. This is last week of the year, right? Last week, 2021, too. All right. So, we're going to do our... Um, kind of like our our year wrap-up. We're going to take it like um, our Spotify wrapped, or he going to take his... Um, I don't know what you call it, Apple Music. Yeah, I got, I got my Apple Music rap. Yeah. And he going he gonna to show his Spotify rap. Yeah, you can't hide, bro. You can't hide from the algorithm, bro. Yeah. So we're going to do our top songs of the year. We've been talking shit about Dunda, and it, we've been at no Dunda. Yeah. Uh, so top three. Top shit, yeah. you know? And we're going to do our... Um, I don't, it, it's, my Spotify doesn't give me the albums that I listen to the most, mm. so I don't know about that, but um, it gave me top, it gave me top song and top artist. Okay, can you, can you only, like, how, how many songs you got for your top? Just five? Right? I got five. Right, it, don't go, it don't go further than that? I mean, I got a whole playlist of shit, but... And I think they're like the... If, if it's an order, then I, I'll do like top 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 20, top 30, or something like that. Because like, when we talk about every last one, I just want to hear... Oh, okay. Like, yeah, yeah, top 20. Yeah, I can talk top 20. Okay, top 20. All right. I wish it was fucking numbered, but it's not, so I got to get it. Apple News can't relate, bro. We got to hand down <laughs> numbers. But it, it is an order. It is an order. All right, so you're in top, top songs? Yep. Uh, top songs. All right. Um, and it... I ain't gonna lie, you're mid music, bro. So my top song didn't even come out this year. Dang. Wait, your Nimmo song didn't come out this year? Did not come out this year. That's sad. Um, Nimmo song is jaded, bro. <laughs> Damn, shit came out, what, two years ago? Yeah, shit came out Scorpion. 2019? Um, what was Jaded's top- definitely classic, though. Um, we're stopping at like, I'm gonna go whole 20. Uh, do your top 10, and then I'll do my top 10, and make it a little less. Okay. Um, number two is, uh, What's Next? Drake and uh, Resistance. Oh, you really like that song? Yeah, um, I still, I still, that song, that song like it feel like a throwaway. It, it, it was, it was catchy, bro. Like it's easy to learn the words, so you kind of like. Yeah, yeah. Um, number three, wants the knees, bro. <laughs> yeah, no OP. <laughs> Looking for that bitch next. Yeah. Uh, number four, over my dead body, Rock Wave. Yeah, David slept, slept on the song. Yeah. Um. Number five is extravagant bullshit slash nunchucks. Tory Lanez. Oh, that song ass guesses. No way. What's in the second half? That's the best part of the. You bugging me. And the fucking beat. I don't think so. I think they do a song. No, it's like it's like it's like it's like freaking tech, isn't it? Like techno beat. Uh, maybe. Pretty sure it is. No, it's a. I got two different bitches. Yes. Nunchucks fire. What? You crazy? That's literally what it is. Um, what number I'm on? Five? I'm on six. Six. Uh, it's Peace by Tim's and Manny Wells. It's just a fire. I ain't heard that. I'm like, it's, it's fire, bro. Fire, bro. Mm. Make you feel like you're from the island, boy. Oh, you uh, heard that song where, what, Tim's and Brit Yeah, I heard it. I like that one. Yeah, it's good. Um, Pipe Down, number seven. Okay, classic. Already. I'm calling that now, man. Yeah. I think I'm going to grow into a freaking fine line. Give it a year or two. Yeah. Number eight, Moon, Kanye West. Mm-hmm. All right. See that? To me, Moon, Moon, it's like one of those songs, mm, I don't know, like, I'm not in the mood for all the time, you know? Mm. Like, like, but when it comes on, it's like, okay, it's a good song. Yeah, I have that song, if I'm in the shower, and the, and the water, hot water turn off, it turns straight cold, I, I gotta turn the song on, bro. Ooh, what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> uh, no pun intended, my number nine is Die Under the Moon. By Young Blue, and John, and John Legend. <laughs> uh, I, I don't. No, I, I don't want to say that. Yeah, I, I, was like, I can't listen to him no more. I mean, he he, he kind of like Alabama. It's not really. Oh. It's not really his song. He's not really on it. Oh. And then that's because Young Blue got a John Legend vibe though. Yeah, that's, and it's the intro for the album too. Oh, wow. Um, and then number ten is Essence with uh, Wizkid and Tim's and Justin Bieber. Okay, solid, 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 solid. Um, all right. I got my top ten right here. All right, yep. my number one song. Did, did, did someone play played it? Huh? No. No, you come on. All right, damn. Okay, I, I'm playing. I'm playing. How many times I played the song? And how many? What's my list? All right, number one. I got calling my phone. All right, bro. I was. I played a snippet of the song before it came out. Yeah. I, I played the shit out of it, but like, like, like it's a full song, man. It was just like the, the hook, bro. Yeah. I'm like, bro, this shit is like gold. Let's talk about this. Yes. Yeah, yeah, it's right. What, whatever it is that 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 song was slept on, bro. Whenever you like not slept on, but like when you think about the song of the year, mm-hmm. I guess because it came out kind of like in the middle or towards like the early part of the year to me. Yeah, you kind of forgot about it. But that's one. That was one of the best songs that came out this year. Definitely, like bro, the hook was fire. I feel like everybody thing 
But that kind of could have been like me kicking him off of it. But I feel like still a classic song. I played that song forty three times already. Mm-hmm. Um, my number two song. Oh no no, I think that from the year. Okay, so uh, my number two song is "Love from Houston" by Rod Wave. Oh yeah, Rod Wave that song. Man. Yeah, yeah bro. <laughs> played twenty nine song twenty nine times. Uh, I played well, my number three is uh, "Over My Dead Body" Rod Wave twenty eight times. Okay. All right, number four. You already know I got this. Mr. Rage, you know? Classic, bro. bro. You played that shit out, bro. Mr. Rage is a hit. It was a hit from the beginning. Hit to this bro, day. Bro, this nigga, right? this nigga was, was a, was a one-man streaming for him. <laughs> like, what? They turned that shit off. No matter what game I'm playing, Fortnite Fighters, I'm, <laughs> I'm playing Mr. Rage, bro. Every time, bro. You hyped up. No matter what it is, it'll be freaking 2 o'clock in the morning. Play Mr. Rage, I'm doing push-ups right then. <laughs> um, number five, I, this is already hit right here. You got to stay. Well, uh, Killer Roy and Justin, B- Justin Bieber. I didn't like that song. I don't know why. I, it's not I like it. I like it. It's definitely like a um, a pop song. You know, yeah, not, not, not really a rap. Um, and Killer Roy, like to me, very slept on. Okay, uh, I, I feel like Killer Roy is slowly going to that post Malone route. You know, mm. which, which the, I'm not really a fan of. You know, because I, I like it more when I like it more in his like music, kind of like in the the urban kind of mm. genre or genre feel. Um, but yeah, I can see him going that route. Um, and he, he just, I think, he's just selling just without the drugs. <laughs> no. Or, yeah, it, it was some songs, you know. Mm-hmm. Some songs he, 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 can, he can tap in that just one bag, I yeah. think. Which is um, ironic because that's just like his mentor, you know. Mm-hmm. Um, then number six, I got Street Runner, Rod Wave. Played 25 times. Number seven, I got Rod Wave, Sneaky Links. 23, yeah. 23 times. <laughs> <laughs> bro, that song is slapped on, man. That, I, I don't even remember that song. Bro, in that song, is so beautiful, bro. I, like, like I, I love that part, bro. I, I, love, I love that song, okay. Number eight, got Once to Need, Little Baby. 22 times. Um, number nine, I got Tombstone. Uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Tombstone when they bury me. <laughs> and then the ten, I got Rob. Bro, Rob, we have one of the albums here. Number ten, I got I got What's Love, Rob, Wave, twenty one times. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now, now, now give me your eleven to twenty, guys. My eleven to twenty. Yeah. Damn, what's, what else I played again? I thought that um number ten. So that would been Essence. So yeah. All right, this, this will get wild. I ain't gonna. <laughs> Yeah, there's an like, Oxymore watch it, yeah. This one nigga wild, bro. <laughs> Alright. For number ten. And I think I think I think Essence just barely beat out um what is number eleven? I think uh Essence just barely just barely beat out um this song. Number eleven was No Friends Industry, Drake. Uh, that song right there. I still okay, first of all, it didn't age well, okay? Because mm-hmm. fucking he squats the beef instantly with Kanye, you know what yeah. I mean? <laughs> So I can't really listen no more. Because mm-hmm. then you got friends now. Um Hello, friend. And I, yeah, I just feel like it felt like yeah, it felt like Drake, fake Drake. Yeah. Uh, bro, go through those, ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Number twelve was Charlene, Anthony Hamilton. Oh, oh, oh song, oh song, oh song, oh song, oh song. Wait, who sang it? Anthony, Anthony Hamilton. Like the music, like the R and B dude. Oh. Yeah. Um. What's that? Uh, number thirteen. I'm on. Mm-hmm. Is sorry not sorry with Nas and uh oh, yeah, like Nas and Nas Nas and Jay Z and Beyonce a little bit um Dang. yeah uh fourteen Alicia Keys you don't know my name all right he's going crazy bro I ain't gonna lie. it's been a wild year um I'm on fifteen fifteen mm-hmm. race my mind Drake yeah, that that one should be higher but I think it, like they whenever they stop cuff the algorithms. I think uh, it kind of yeah, slid down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. Um, number 16 is Cranes in the Sky, Solange. Um, yeah, she, she had a pretty good album, but that, that's probably the best song going there. Uh, 17? I should not remember, bro. I'm not remembering it. <laughs> you ain't getting it. Okay. Yeah. All right. 4 for 4, Jay Z. All right. Um, 18, Lay It Down, Lloyd. Another old song. <laughs> uh, 19. That song? Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Nineteen. Um I don't this should be way higher, but it's TSU, Drake. Okay, okay, okay. Because like, the second half go hard, bro. So you have TSU goes just goes oh, stupid hard, bro. No, Travis Park? It's TSU, ain't it? No, uh, Daddy is not around. Oh oh second half I'm TSU. Bugging, I'm bugging, I'm bugging. TSU go way too hard, bro. Not, I gotta skip the first like forty five second of the song. Listen man. <laughs> <laughs> and then um I guess I number twenty was look how God works, Tory Lanez. Yeah. <laughs> he said right. that, I think still he did that shit. But 
know about that. Now, when it's coming out, we, we, we yeah. talk about that when I come out. I, I ain't talking about that until it's like Philly finally yeah. did and done. Her bullet, fragment, bullet fragments are like disappearing. Yeah, there's some spooky shit going on around that case. But my 11 to 20, I got Late at Night, all right? Late which late I thought I was night. like the only hit on the album anyway, first place. <laughs> um, number 12, I got a. I, bro, this song is such a classic to me. I, I can't not listen to it. Every time I come on, I can't skip it, bro. It was the the intro to uh, Trippie's album, uh, Lorray. Wait, is it, no, not that, is that, is that, is that, uh, is that the intro? Yeah, I think Lorray, I think Lorray, yeah, Lorray's like, he, he, he gives like a little speech, and he's like, I need you to show me. I don't want to say that shit. I don't know. That's shit. I love that song, man. And then number 13, I got Hellcat and Trackhawks, bro. Bro, when I, when I feel like a goon, even though I'm not a goon, bro, yeah, I ain't about that life, put uh, on yeah. Hellcat and Trackhawks, bro, by, by Lil Durk, <laughs> man. Number 14, I got Limper Freestyle. Come on, man. Shit my whole, that's it, shit my whole freaking meal prep, you know? Yeah. Uh, 15, I got Anna Bible, Lil Durk, give me on. I would expect this to be in here, so high up. Dang, bro, you low key Anna Bible fan, bro. Huh? You low key Anna Bible fan. Yeah, I guess so. Um, and the Indian Cosmetics line got you, bro. It, yeah, it really did. Uh, number 16. I ain't ashamed of shit, man. Girls need love. You miss, bro. It's still up there? It's still up there, bro. <laughs> and I be singing her part, bro. I'm gonna fuck. I'm gonna fuck. I just need some. <laughs> I'm gonna fuck, bro. Um, but, but Drake's song, you know his song now, yeah. bro. Anyway, uh, number 17, I got Still Chose You by Kit Leroy. Fire, slept on song. Mm -hmm. um, number 18, I got Poppy's Home. I love that song, bro. Mm -hmm. I love it. It might be, if not my top three, yeah, the top three, top, top three um, COB songs. Mm -hmm. Uh, number 19, I got Pills and Bills by Rod Wave. I don't expect the song to be there either, but yeah. hey, I guess I'm true. That's not good, bro. It's good. Um, then, number 20, I give the bro. One of my favorite songs of this year, bro, is Good Days by Sister. Oh, yeah, that song. I love that song, man. Like, when I was doing Relax, I put that shit on, yeah, man, bro. I kind of, I like, I like freaking, um, what's that song you just came up with? I Hate You. I, I, the beat for that song is fire, bro. Oh, I, 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 I haven't heard that one. I kind of want, I kind of want instrumental, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> <laughs> she, yeah, she'd be, she be doing some some yeah. fire beats. But, uh, you wanna go into your top, top artists? Top artist. Oh, that's easy. <laughs> and they tell you how many times, how many hours you played them? Uh, let me check. Damn, nigga, don't spoil yourself today. Come on. No, don't tell my artists. I mean, tell my hours I did it, but I'm sure it's a lot of fucking hours. Um, my number one artist this year was Drake. Obviously. Uh, number two this year, Triple Red. I better be Black Square, Steve. Number three, <laughs> Kanye West, bro. Cause, Cause I actually went back and listened to my lot of old shit before I done dropped out just to see what mm -hmm. happens. Like. Um, number four, Rock Wave, bro. Saddest nigga. Number five is uh Brent Fiennes. All right, all right, all right. Um, it says this year I listened to a total of three hundred thirty-eight different artists. All right, and my favorite are, drum roll, drum roll, drum roll. Number one, Drake. Ain't no surprise, you know. <laughs> Listen to Drake, 42 hours. Uh, number two, Triple Red, 27 hours. Number three, Rye Wave, 15 hours. Number four, The Kid Leroy, 12 hours. Number five, Bryson Tiller, 12 hours. And now this is, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry how many hours, all right. Mm -hmm. Then I got Just World, Tory Lanez, um, Lil TJ, Lil Dirk, Party Next Door, Lil Baby, Lil Tekka, Polo G, Young Thug. Damn. This is all over, too. Uh, Pot Smoke, Joji, J. Cole, Roddy Rich, X, um, and last is Kanye West, bro. Damn. I rap, I rap and talk about, bro. I rap, I rap that shit, bro. He was done the ones. <laughs> I rap that shit, bro. Yeah, when, see, I, when, I, when I say I love that shit, I don't listen to that shit, bro. Next year, CJ, you gonna be here, bro. We gotta, we, we gonna get him right, bro. We gonna right. Yeah, yeah. Next, this year, CJ look quiet because he, he he new to the scene, you know. Yeah. Next year, you gonna be better. You, you know that everyone went to the age when like everyone listens to MMA music, video game music, bro. Gotta, <laughs> like just me, <laughs> just me. Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I, I feel like I always been like not like in tune, but like I remember, cause remember me from PS3, we was speaking dialogue music and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like it, like from Mookie, like um. Yeah, that's shit. Like shit on his PS3, we yeah. go back and listen to our music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I feel like we always been like in there in the yeah. know, but not like super in the know. But yeah. now I feel like we like low key best in this bitch. But yeah, you, you say you didn't have top albums. No, it mine's not giving top albums. All right. Um, it, then I'm, my albums, I listened to 120 albums this year, right? 120. Now, my top albums, number one. Y'all know what it is. The pregnant emojis finna get tattooed on me, bro. <laughs> I got CLB, you know, Certified Lover Boy, 124. Uh, yeah, 124 plays. 
Um, then number two, I got uh, Fuck Love by Kent Leroy. Three, all right, because he released he was, he was the deluxe 3000 album, bro. So, like, it's almost uh-huh. a three-part, which I love, man. So, I listened to that 66, 66 times. Number three, I would not expect to be so high up, was Hall of Fame by Polo G. Um, yeah, you like Hall of Fame, bro. Like, I, I liked it, but, like, I didn't like that much. I like one of our ways. I grew up in no lie. I like one of our ways. I feel like I feel like I just had a lot of he had he had more some more songs than Rock Wave, so I'm, I'm play, like I feel like I just played it more, you know. Mm. Um, but number four I got Soulfly, Rock Wave. Number five, what the fuck is? This? Oh wait, never mind. I read this shit. Nah, <laughs> shit, bro. It's, I read this shit, bro. <laughs> what is that? What live, is that? Live life as <laughs> number, number five. <laughs> this cat, bro. You got that shit in. You know, you know, I know this cat, bro, because on Spotify, on Spotify, on Spotify, they put um Wakisha in my song, my song of the year, bro. My song, of the year. <laughs> nigga. I ain't hear that shit like all this shit on radio, bro. On TikTok, I never put this in my song. <laughs> Secretly. <laughs> <laughs> Roller coaster. <laughs> I do. I do not listen. To that. They're lying, bro. They're lying. It said thirty nine times. I played. I'm album. always good. <laughs> they're lying. They're lying. I've been since I got done. The thirty four times I played that album. Um, well, I'm playing listen to. I'm gonna find listen to um, Live Fast. Live Fast. Thirty nine times. Ah! <laughs> I just love this. I should have done that. Um. Then I got number seven. I got call me if you get lost. Uh. I played that 31 times. I played Slime Language 2 for the, uh, 20 times, Pegasus 15 times, and then Tory Lanez number 10, uh, 13 album, 13 times. Did we put Young Fuzz album as one of the worst albums of the year? Wait, Punk? Yeah, the, the weird, the pink looking thing. I feel like Punk got wrong me. That's why I put it on there. Oh, okay. Because it, it got some songs that like, because I've heard that like that, um, and I love you more. Yeah, you said that. You said that. Song. And then I was like, okay, this is this is go. All right. <laughs> But yeah, that's my wrap up. That's our wrap up. That's our wrap up. All right, bro. Uh, if, y- if y'all, if y'all, if y'all are fucking with it, if y'all fucking with it, let us know. Put your wrap up in the comments. Or whether y'all on Twitter or DM us on Twitter. Put your wrap up is. But let's get to the demon shit. Uh, not a lot of games. A lot. It's a lot of freaking like. Oh, Marvel shit. It's Marvel like. Little... Yeah, a lot of Marvel. <laughs> Marvel enemy. Yeah. Um. All right. So I started trending today, and they quickly um, it's quickly stopped trending because I guess it's more than important, but uh. Thing. I Wait, saw that. Like I guess it's like people weren't really like caring that much. So like it's just uh, like it was like a loud minority or something. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Um this whole um you everybody know um Chadwick Bosman, he just played um T'Challa, Black Panther, he passed away uh was last year. Yep. Yeah. And um RP. The um producers for the movie pretty much said he's not gonna recast him, uh they're just gonna like, you know, put a work around it. Mm-hmm. And like the drama surrounding like um the the lady I can't Latita right I think who plays um Shuri. She don't want the vaccine, bro. She fumbling the, the Disney bag, so she ain't getting the vaccine. She don't we really don't want it. And um, there's rumors that she might even quit the movie. Yeah, I heard that too. Um, people were, people were calling for the recast of uh, T'Challa, and there's an argument that's saying like you know, okay, recast him because like I'm no I don't I don't think he want his uh want the captain to die with him, mm-hmm. you know. Um, some people saying like, "Oh no, honor him by like letting the character like him be the last person to play with him in like the modern history." What do you guys follow on that? Do you think? I know we talked about it before when you first like passed away, but I know it was not appropriate. Appropriate, like really. Yeah, yeah. You go talk, deep into it. Talk about this. It's yeah. So, so I think times passed. Um, what do you what do you guys think? Because it, it got to come out, bro. It's not, they're not not going to yeah. put up put up Black Panther. So you think they should recast them or just give a man to somebody else? Like give it to like. It don't be the child anymore, just somebody else. Because you go first. Yeah. <sighs> well, I think. Mm, I think they should uh, give them to somebody else. Cause, give them to somebody else? Yes. Because, uh, and I know it's been like a, a little while since I watched uh, the Black Panther movie. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I think, I think they're right about the. He didn't want the character to die with them, die with him. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know, yeah, that's pretty much it. But. So you do want him to recast? Hmm? You want to do? You do want him to get recast? So no, you, you know, hmm? you know, oh, rega- oh, you, you want to, you want the mental. Yeah, mental, mental. Like I think. So yeah, it, a mental is yeah, yeah. A me- so the mental is somebody in MCU already already in MCU are a new character comes to MCU and, and comes back Panther. Yeah, a recast is. Someone yeah, acting like that's the child now. Yeah. Like 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 cast cast it the role of the child the child. The child yeah. Like, and ever like he's been here for the whole Avengers movies before. Yeah. They, they, they don't address that Chadwick 
T'Challa has passed away or anything like that. Oh, yeah. I think they should have passed the mantle. Passed the mantle. Like, yeah. So, not, no more no more T'Challa, a new, a new, a new Batman. Yeah. Because, like... So, you do want a character hmm? to die with him. Yeah. Like, have the character die with... Well, the character's not going to... The all character know, T'Challa is hmm? going to... Not going to be there anymore. Yeah, he's, he's not going to be there anymore. Mm-hmm. But the Black Panther will be. Yes, but the Black Panther will be. Like... If someone else will take the Black Panther's name. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's a great opinion. Um, cause that, a lot of people fall on that side. I think the majority of people kind of fall on that side. Mm. Um, I yeah. think... Yeah. I honestly, though, I felt, I felt like that, I think, originally. But now, I'm kind of leaning towards the recast. Not gonna lie. I lean, lean, lean towards the recast because... Um, one, I'm not, not in no respect to the Tabard Boss Man or his family, bro. But, like, he didn't, like, create the character, you know? It, like, it, it, he, just, he just played the character. You know, um, I don't think, like, God forbid, like, um, Tom Holland would pass away. I don't think they would, like, bring him out. Bro. I think they would just bring the Peter Parker in, you know, that one day. Mm-hmm. It's just because they built something already. Yeah. So, I think it would keep, I think, I don't know him personally, but I feel like, as an actor, I feel like they wouldn't want, like, to be just typecast as, like, no one just as Black Panther, you know? I think it'd be cool to, like, to compare it, like, it would challenge someone else to, like, to be a better Black Panther or be, like, a try to live up to that name, you know? Um, I, I just think he's, a, I think he's, um, a big, a big character, like, a big, like, um, Deshaun's a huge, like, he's a big Avenger, like, he's not, like, one of the, the smaller B-sides to me, you know? I think if, like, Robert Downey were to pass away, I don't think, I mean, maybe now it don't matter, but, like, earlier, mm-hmm. I think they wouldn't have just, they, they, they wouldn't just threw Iron Man's head away. I think they would have kept Tony Stark there, you know? They would have kept, gotten there Tony Stark. So, Honestly, I think they should on recast him, bro. Because I, I think it helped, and it helped the story too. They have to worry about Shuri, whatever was going on with her. I think this helps the story, go smoothly. You know, I think audiences are more like uh, flexible than people think they are. You know, and I think um, it'll make for a worse movie if they don't recast him. To be honest. Yeah. See, I, mm, I, see I, I disagree. I disagree. I disagree. Um, to me, I think the perfect route would, would, would be, um, well, okay, if Shuri's out of here, mm-hmm. then recast okay. Cause like then then it's like, like two like bro it's too many like quits like now nah, he now nah, she going he going type shit you know mm-hmm. um and I don't, I don't want to make no like okay some big old explosion happened or they both died in the explosion you know yeah um yeah. it it's just like it just feel like it would feel like I'm watching a movie I don't, it won't, it won't feel like true experience you know mm-hmm. I, I don't want to feel like real life you know watching a freaking Marvel movie um so the round an hour ago if I was in development I would go with um give somebody else a mental all right. And then later we, we we like whether it's like, um, like I don't know if they want to redo the Black Panthers, like kind of series, then like give T'Challa his his like like I will let him I will let T'Challa die in the movie okay, mm-hmm. um and then let's say if they want to bring back some number like you know how they did Christopher, they doing Christopher right now, yeah. if they want to do that, like this this this, this is different universes T'Challa you know, and he jumped through on the stair type shit yeah, mm-hmm. I I I would do that. Cause like bro, he he had he hasn't been dead that long, bro. He hasn't been dead that long, all right. And whether you like it or not, like he left a legacy behind, like like with, with the uh, whole Black Panther thing. Mm-hmm. Even though I, I'm not, it could it could have been. I'm not trying to just discredit him. Um, it, it might have been Black Panther than Black Panther movie, you know. Mm-hmm. And they would have got that legacy, you know. Cause like just just what the movie meant to the Black community, all that stuff. Even like the MCU community overall, you know. Yeah. So that's where I would take. I would, I would I would let someone take the mantle for now. Reintroduce a different child later, you know. Yeah. Cause, cause I still like still still soon it won't sit right to me, going to theaters, um, and everybody like like freaking Ant Man pull up and like what's up to the child or something like that, and it's not it's not chat with you know, mm-hmm. like like it, it just won't sit right to me. I don't know. It it would have to make sense. I don't know. Even not like Marvel movies made make the most complete sense, but like it would have to be like to me it would have to make sense. So, like if if they didn't if they if they didn't recast them, like. It can't be like, oh, he had a son we didn't know about, you know, like, oh, it can't be like somebody like his son aged up and now he's mm-hmm. like the same age, you know. But it can be so easy to re- to, to to recast. I mean, I mean to get under somebody else. It's so easy. I, like, like I feel like the T'Challa. Uh, I'm not sure if y'all words Christ in that carefully. T'Challa isn't that crazy of a character, you know, like he, like his like himself, you know. I, I guess you, I guess you can. You just need somebody who loves Wakanda. Yes, and it could be it could be, I guess, it could be a no name that we've never seen before, and yeah. that that come to the that rises up, you know, type yeah. shit. Like he can he, he don't need to be royalty. He'd be like, damn, I literally him. 
type shit, you know? Mm-hmm. And like now he want to be like he wanna, he like he feel like he's, oh, he's worthy enough to take that mental. Yeah. Like, cause I I just feel like if he get recasted, it's, it it breaks the whole illusion, you know? Mm-hmm. Like like even if they want to show like flashbacks like of old scenes. Yeah. Like you be like that's not that's not real him. That's not really him, you know? Like yeah. Like, it don't it won't it just won't feel right. It won't feel yeah. like it won't feel legit. Yeah. Yeah. Fine. But like, I think we can all agree though that the audience is more flexible than you think it was. So if people think that it won't make sense for him to be recast or people think he, he should be recast. At the end of the day, I think the audience will be able to accept both, you know? Like, um, I, I don't, right now, I don't think that they gave Shuri enough shine for her to be, and I don't think people like her enough. Yeah, I don't think they, they gave her enough to, yeah. to like, um, to, to be a successful Black Panther, you know? Mm. I think, Shuri the main character is not going crazy in box offices. Box yeah. offices. Unless it's gonna be like a team of Panthers, and then and that kind of takes nope. over too. That's yeah. A, yeah, still not gonna go hard as well. Yeah. Yeah. I think the best thing is is probably to give it, give it man to somebody else, bro. I'm telling you. Yeah, I, my, we, 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 you just breaking it down like how you just did it. I I I can go either way, but I wouldn't I wouldn't hate like giving it to like a not no name, but pretty much no name, and having them as long as his story makes sense. Yeah, like bro, yeah. Like, give it give it to a no name. Or, yeah, because I, I don't want anybody else who we've seen already. I mean, I'm fine with someone else did. Mm-hmm. Someone we have seen becomes a Batman 3. Um, but I would rather have, like, a no-name rise up, you know, type shit. Because, yeah. like, bro, I, I could literally see him, like, almost like a, like, not a, to- not a Tony, um, not a Tony uh, Peter situation. Because, mm-hmm. like, Black Panther's his own character. You really don't need, like, a father figure type shit. Yeah. You know? But I can see, like, I look here looking up to Chadwick Boseman or um, T'Challa, the child Boseman, Chadwick Boseman, T'Challa. Mm-hmm. And be like, damn, bro, I'm, I want to be the next Black Panther. Yeah, and yeah. I, I guess they they kind of have the I won't say perfect, but like the a good like um, wiggle room because it could have been like somebody who's like maybe like 20 when Chadwick got snapped, and yeah. then it's five years of like whatever you know. So somebody had to be king for those five years anyway. Mm-hmm. So somebody was taking over anyway. So I I, I do wonder how they gonna like. Uh, I'm interested to see. I, I I don't know. I'm not gonna judge them too harshly for whatever they do. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's hard. Yeah, yeah, hard. Yeah, they're hard to play. Whether whether whatever move they make is gonna yeah. be it's gonna be hit. So like, I would never be like be crazy yeah. on them like this. Yeah. Let's do some money shit. Like some like some easily some like some some scummy shit. Yeah. <laughs> bring bring back um Chris Evans as uh <laughs> the, yeah. white, the white Panther. Bring bring Chris Pratt. <laughs> Chris Pratt, everybody, bro. Mario, yeah. fucking everybody. Yeah. But keep it, keep it Marvel, keep it rolling, keep it Marvel. Um, we already gave our Spider Man review last week. Um, that's probably one of our longest, longest episodes talking about Spider Man. Um, but like, there's been rumors floating around. I don't know if it's Sony trying to have fun, picking on like teasing the freaking fans. Yeah, a lot of rumors going on, bro. Um, I probably a lot of fake shit too. Yeah, me too. I think a lot of fake shit. Nice. Do trust me. Yeah, do trust me, shit. Um, one of the first rumors I saw was um, Electro getting his own movie. Don't want that. Uh-huh. I don't, want that. don't want Jamie Fox getting his own movie. I ain't gonna lie. I mean, nothing, nothing. Need shit no more. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, I don't need that, bro. I don't need a uh, Electro movie. Um, who is he going yeah. against? The he's a Batman in America, bro. <laughs> like, like, does he have powers anymore? I don't know. I really don't know if they, he's something about to death. Or what happened? But <laughs> yeah, I said again. You say he's something all weaker, weaker, smart. <laughs> 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 Send them all back with one HP. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Um, I don't want that. So I don't know if you want to. Oh, oh damn! Your niggas gonna watch it. Only the first thing I haven't seen yet. Um, cause they don't get they don't get a shit to jam with me. So they got it right. Yeah. Still the high seas, bro. Um, no, we don't want Electro movie, bro. I get it. That Jane Fox is iconic legend. He was he he, legend. Did, he was a decent Electro in the movie. Uh, uh, I, I mean, I, I, you know, I haven't uh, seen this level here. Um, more, more weird on the weirder side. Um, I like that. I like the idea. Don't like the actress. They're trying to bring back. Um, there's rumors that they want Emma Stone for her own Spider Man movie. Wait, was he like character like the actor? I don't like the a- actress. I don't think she was like. Oh yeah. yeah, yeah. I like her as the like, Gwen Stacy, but I think to I me, Emma Stone, I like Emma Stone in every movie, bro. Yeah, but Spider Gwen to me is like. She's not female Peter Parker, but like she from I may have a good watch movie. She didn't give me no hero vibes anyway. I, I, it, it wouldn't make sense. I don't say it's swinging wrong, bro. Yeah, like at least from my scene in Spider Verse. Yeah, she's like kind of not tomboy, but like like she's kind of like she she don't need nobody, bro. Yeah, like the Gwen Stacy that we see in the movie kind of is kind of like 
That's uh, Denzel in the Traps. Yeah, I mean, obviously they can change, they can rewrite her, but like, I don't know. I don't. I don't, I don't see her fucking, fucking cutting her hair, fucking going out middle of the night by herself, beating them niggas up. I don't, yeah, I don't it don't make sense, bro. She, she. I mean, she could obviously buff up, buff up, but she's kind of skinny, you know. Like, I know, I know, people probably like biggest dude ever, but like, it, it doesn't seem. I just don't want her. Like, I just feel like she, first of all, I don't think she's good at actor. Damn, <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna say that right now. I, I just don't. I don't know. I, I never like. I never liked her as Gwen Stacy in person. Yeah, place. give us Scarlett Johansson. Um. <laughs> she's too old, but, but yeah. Yeah. Well, I won't say that. I won't say I she's too old. old. I don't think she's so. too old. I don't think so. She's too old, I guess. She's definitely too old. <laughs> what? She's you too old because they see. Yeah, we're saying not. They're not Tina Trevor. She's too fucking old, though. No matter what, what? No matter what. Like Scarlett needs our family, bro. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I I, I get it. Each their own. Um, but I think that'll be a cool concept. I I, I, I don't hate a Spider Man movie. I, I wouldn't. I'll, I'll probably go see it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll see it too. Yeah. yeah. Wait, about Sony? Yeah, I think Sony's the one doing it. Um, Sony will see movie guys. But they saw, they saw the quick Billy that um, Spider Man made. They're trying to make their own shit, bro. Shit, I wait too. Um, what's the other rumor? Oh. Oh. They want to make an amazing Spider Man 3. Um, Honestly, I'm not against it. Maybe mm-hmm. a different director or a different writer. Yeah. Because I think Man Spider Man 1. Was, was decent. I think it was decent. Mr. Spider Man 2. They both bad to me. He, he, his, his take on Spider Man is just a weird one, you know? He's he just a. He's super awkward. But you, you think his Spider Man like, awkward too, or just Peter Parker? Yes! Like, uh, he's, he's literally. He's awkward in there. He's awkward in the whole and, thing of, of, that, of No Way Home. He's awkward. And then Sue, oh, that was You see, that was your first time seeing Andrew Garfield as Spider Man, right? Yeah. How, what, what, what was your take on him? Cause you pretty much you pretty much a target idea. Like they did a lot of fan fiction, man, man, fanfare for us, like a fan service for like people yeah. know everything. But people like you are like the target audience. So what do you think of, uh, of Andrew? Uh, yeah, I say it was kind of awkward. The man was like hanging from the ceiling, and say, no. It was like he's like, like bro, this shit fucking web. Stop, no, this shit a web. Why you so weird? <laughs> this spooky Spider Man, bro. I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. So. <laughs> um, like me, like me personally, I'm fi- like as long as it don't hinder it, MCU Spider Man, mm-hmm. shit, I don't give a fuck, nigga. Make, 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 make but where you gonna see, it. like where you gonna see it? Like, would you? Oh yeah, yeah, I'll see it. Cause like now, like I feel like I even more touch Spider Man. So like, like I'm just, like, I, I, I think if we can give me a half ass, I probably still go try to watch it. You know, I, I'm interested to see, like, um, he said he said he's a more adventurous Spider Man. I'm interested to see what what that looks like. Oh what? He said he's more adventurous. Like, I don't think no more. If, 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 unless it's like go back in time I feel like, I feel like go back in time I don't think it like okay, if, if, you think it take quick take part right after cause I wasn't sure I don't know if it was last podcast but it didn't want you to tell like it kind of sounded like they just left off wherever they is off on like, when the movie started and it's not like they kept being Spider-Man it's not like kind of like the latest no no no, no. It, it, it's not like they that's how you know he's vengeful cause like he's been doing he, he kept doing it and like now he's now Spider-Man he is now is like beating his asses yeah well, fucking, if he's a vengeful then, he must fuck around the heart bro if he, mm-hmm. if he a vengeful rather like, when he's dead, he must have fucked Rhino up. Nigga, you see Rhino in heaven? In heaven? Doing the end of the movie? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone Spider-Man put in the pack is coming back. <laughs> I can't stop him. Uh, oh, yeah. I, and I understand, too. Like, niggas who are dead, well, like, I, I don't understand. They, they got, they, you know, they, they pull niggas from back in time. and I don't, They didn't I explain that. Didn't yeah, that. well, they get some, get some back in time. Because, like, um... Doc Ock was dead, but oh, last thing I remember was like the last thing they remember before they died. Yeah. Much. So why did it go back in time? Why did it go back in time? I don't understand that. Uh, it's a fan fiction, bro. Fan, fan fiction, bro. Yeah, yeah, okay. Um, I also don't know why Jim Fox is back, but because I don't think he knew who he was. He thought he was black. Huh? He didn't know who Peter Parker was. Electro. What do you mean? Do you know he was in that movie? No. He knew he. Oh, no, no, I was probably too. No. So what's the point? Why is he back? Like is everybody who knew Peter Parker supposed to come back? Oh, I get it. You got you want Jane Fox back, but you you want you, I think there's one the villain Electro. They wanted another. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, oh shit, that's possible. Eh, whatever. We we'll, we'll bury that shit out. Um, I think there was another rumor. Uh, oh, but what about like the Venom thing? Like yeah. the Venom. I think a lot of niggas trying to like push for Miss Marvel three. You like Venom versus um, Andrew Garfield. Uh, Tom Hardy, like that villain. Yeah. Um. The worst Spider-Man was in him, bro. I don't know. I, I'm kind of, I kind of root for him. I'm not gonna lie. In a fight. Yeah. <laughs> I, I thought, I thought the way he fight. Um, but. Yeah. Oh no, no, no. It, I think it, it, it'd be interesting. 
You know, hey, we'll finally get to see it. It'd be, I, I feel like that would be a good movie. Yeah, it'd be them, a good movie. If it was them two, the old movie. Um, but like, I don't see like again what Tom Hardy, the way he did Tom Hardy's um Venom. I don't see him, him going against a good person, you know. Yeah, like he already seemed like he morally good, you know. Yeah, it's been it's been that's kind of like off the hinges, but yeah, he's Venom's not that evil. I think I think the only thing that can happen is if like um Spider Man. Venom said he can eat a fucking chicken because it was his friend. I just thought about that shit. All the only way that can happen is if like you know the girlfriend that they keep bringing back on Venom, Tom Hart, Tom Hardy's girlfriend. Maybe if Spider Man like chose not to save her or like didn't save her. Not chose not to save her, like like he, like, he, he didn't focus on something else. Yeah, he fought fucking Electro and she ended up dying. I'm sure. Yeah, and she ended up dying. That's the only way I can see maybe like changing. And that, I think that's the perfect thing they need for um fucking Venom. Um, I think the same person who like um directed like the um what's the movies the Rise of the Apes mm-hmm. directs like Venom and stuff like at least directed Venom too. Damn. Um. Right, it's pretty good though. Yeah, I just maybe it's not him. Maybe it's the character. The character of him to me is just not right. It's like he's okay. If you look at the little the little moral swinging thing, he's too far on the good side to me. Like he's too he too right there in the awkwardly good. Bro, side. I feel like Austin Ted. Yeah, like it was like a kind of funny ish. Like I don't care about humor. I'm used to the Marvel movies, but he was too like morally on the on the good side to me. Like it it, it, it takes away from the character to me. Like. I get it. He's supposed to be anti-hero, but he's morally he's more of a hero with like sometimes questionable, questionable uh, like morals, you know. Yeah. But it might work. The, the weirdest Spider-Man and the weirdest Venom together in the same movie. Mm-hmm. It, it could work. It could work. I definitely gonna see it, bro. All right now, I'm still writing the Spider-Man Spider-Man high, so they can give me anything with web on it. I might go see that shit. I'm yeah, like, exactly. I might go watch Charlotte's Web or something. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I think. I think the one last rumor I heard was um, maybe they want to do like another like Sam Raimi Spider Man like Spider Man Four. But the to- I, what Toby? I don't think Toby want to do that shit. <laughs> Toby, what, Toby, what joke when he gets his back out? Yeah, I don't think Toby want to do. I think Toby's almost like fifty. I think he's in the fifties, bro. No, I think he's like half forties, like forty six. Yeah. It, we, I don't even say podcast. It looked look, look like he want to beat her, bro. Yeah, he really, <laughs> he really didn't like going to beat her. I don't know if he looked, I don't know if he's tired or yeah, like he yeah, not he, like he want to beat her, bro. But yeah, I. See that. What were your thoughts on like the Toby Spider Man? Toby Spider Man. Yeah. Uh, I think it was better than Andrew. You know. Mm-hmm. Uh. They had a better character. Yeah, I mean, that's about it. Well, well, but one thing I didn't like about the movie that that I don't, I don't keep going back and forth with that mm-hmm. movie, like movie review almost. Yeah. <laughs> we're talking about it right now. I, I didn't like. I guess it was the way that it. The easiest way to different, differentiate, 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 yeah, differentiate who was who was yeah. keeping the mask off. Yeah, but I feel like it was not enough mask on. You know, yeah, it was too dark. That's not, that's, that's what I think. It was too dark, bro. It was way too dark. Yeah, I think if it was night, if it was daytime, we could have the same fight. If it was daytime, you could see. Which I, which. I feel like I seen I seen Toby's face more than I seen Toby and mask. Yeah, like, a yeah. little, little yeah. too much. Like yeah. like his freaking his bags on his eyes. Yeah. yeah. Staring him down, but, but, but when you did see it, because when he's like fighting the same man in the, in the um in the little tower, yeah, that shit stuff it looks clean, bro. Yeah, like, yeah, it looked like the OG. Yeah, it looked, it looked like OG, but like more fluid, you know. Yeah, yeah. It was. Cool. So I wish I'd seen that more until yeah. you seen this neck up. I mean, neck down. Yeah. I did. Sorry, was doing it. Ain't gonna lie. Um, I think Tom said he's taking like a couple years off acting, bro. Uh, you want to make quick Billy? I don't know. Obviously, he didn't make Auto Man, but like, I don't know. Bro. Hey, he got Charlie coming out. Yeah, and Charlie oh, coming yeah. out. Which I don't think. I'm not trying to be good. I don't know how it was. Are you going to see it in theaters? Mm. Hey, wait, 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 it's coming to HBO Max? Yeah, where's it going to come out? I think it's theaters. I don't think it's coming out. I'm, I'm a, it, it depends how dry the season is. Yeah. Like, if it does do, then maybe I'll go, I'll go check it out. Yeah. I do love Uncharted. I do love Uncharted. But yeah, I, I, I don't know. Like, I'm sorry to see what we do next, Spider Man. Why really? Their best bet, bro. Why they still doing this whole legal shit? Like, I, I think I think it's pretty much over with legal legal shit. I think it's pretty much they just can keep doing what they're doing. I think I think they fucking made a billion dollars. They can work some out, bro. Mm-hmm. I think gonna end that. Um I think it'd be cool to see um Miles, bro. I think it would be cool. It's still too soon to be. Think so? Not like the way they're doing Tom, it's like okay, Tom's finally finna become like Spider Man Spider Man. Yeah, they both are kinda young, like Yeah, like, like, yeah. like I'd rather have Peter have some more time to shine, then we bring in Miles. Yeah, make I, I, I think make him old, like, he needs one more movie where he Cause I think whatever has happened to him, like the Art May, 
This is post Wonder, bro. Aunt May dying and all that shit. Um, I think they're definitely changing. Like, I think that's definitely, like, he's no longer like the. I think he can joke around, bro. But, like, I think he's no more, because Iron Man already know who he was, even if he was alive. Iron Man wouldn't know. Like, it's no more, like, Iron Boy. It's Spider Man, bro. It's Spider Man. Mm-hmm. Like, I think this is the. The, the full grown Sony again. Uh, yeah, I hope, yeah, I hope we don't get cut, get it cut short with some bullshit with Sony. And, yeah, yeah, because like I don't think you need one movie. I think you need, need like two or three. Two or three? I, I, I think I think a two, two a good two more movies, and then bring in Miles if they wanted to. Oh, Cause like, like bro, Miles. like I we still haven't got like yeah like a true like the Spider Man solo movie almost. Mm-hmm. Like every time it's been like him and the but somebody else, you know. I would love to see Tom because he's good. He's good at Spider Man. He fights fantastic. He does his own fucking stunts. Mm-hmm. Um, like every, he, everything he does is feels like soul Spider Man. Like like mm-hmm. I don't see like, no awkward moments with him. Listen for me. Like he, he's a good Peter Parker. Mm-hmm. Um, I just love, I would love to see him uh, like age up. You know, yeah. naturally. Yeah, definitely. Before, before we get to Miles, because you know Miles takes takes time, bro. Yeah, Miles Miles is just fucking time, but black. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Would. I don't know. Especially, yeah, especially this kid. Like this kid, like Miles, mm-hmm. like my teenage Miles. Yeah. Like, niggas taking that. Snatching it, bro. Yeah, but they could do it because, like I said, it, like, for five years, he could, whatever age he is, he could be like, he might should be older than him now. Ooh. Miles could be. I don't, I don't want to old Miles. Though. Yeah, I, I'd rather have like the almost the end of Spider Verse. Yeah, but then it, it'd be like, why are you having that? Because in Spider Verse, like, and they, and they both put around the same numbers. I feel like. Yeah. yeah. Oh no, no, I feel like uh, I realize one. I really want to be more liberated than us. Definitely. In Spider Verse. Yeah, because some niggas don't. They, they want to even give an animated movie a chance. Yes, hundred percent. Alright, uh, I think we're good for the Spidey talk. I'm sure he'll sneak his way back in here eventually. I'm saying it's um, Spidey versus Robo. Actually, might talk about him on here. The Hawkeye finale, bro. You, 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 yeah, watch okay, it. Okay, I'm for it. Hawkeye finale, alright? Spoiler alert for Hawkeye. Alright? Anyway, we're going to go. You want to do like a series review too? Like, series review? Yeah, series, we're going to do the series in the whole. Alright? Um, I feel like this series started off. Kind of strong. It's not a super strong. It's not a strong, bro. Super strong. Um, I think the only gripe I had in the beginning, which I have, which, which every freaking uh, Marvel show they do in Disney Plus, I wish the seriousness was toned up just a little bit. It, it, Hawkeye kind of had it. Hawkeye was probably the most serious. Yeah, mm-hmm. he definitely, he definitely maybe maybe Winter Soldier. Um, oh wait, wait what? Maybe the um, the Captain America uh, Winter Soldier thing. Yeah. But. Oh, the seriousness. I wish the seriousness was just the, oh, the tone of the show. Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. That definitely, definitely serious. That more serious. Definitely. Yeah. I wish a little more serious. Yeah, especially at that wisdom speech. Yeah. But it was sort of pretty strong, bro. Like, um, I didn't, I didn't hate Kate Bridges' character. Yeah, yeah. I, I like it way more than I thought I would. Yeah. I thought I wouldn't really, really care, care for her that much. Didn't hate her character. Um, she's like she's about to cry in, in moment. But I think it's her face. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> um... She better be the whole show. The whole show. Damn, she be the like, damn, bro. She didn't get like some makeup on. Yeah. Like, fucking. She put the whole part, whole ball gown <laughs> bleeding. Um, she stitched up everywhere. I'm yeah. Like, damn, bro. Um, I'm, I no no offense against like the, the diversity stuff and all that stuff. I wasn't a huge fan of Echo. Like, yeah. Yep. I wasn't a huge fan of like the whole, you know, I, if they can do a sign language thing, I wish they just do it. Yeah. Like, just do it. I don't need the, the whole, like, the when I'm sounding out something like that, I get it. You kind of, Everybody knows sign language on the show. You should learn too. Just do the sign language thing. Give me some titles. Cause like, to me, when they let sound it out, it kind of just takes away from like the. It is, it's basically wait, 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 what do you mean sound it out? Like when like, they like they would like make little noises. Yeah, when they're like doing it. Yeah, like um, we're all in this. To, I don't want to mess it up, but like all in this together. Like I think like you know like, I'm talking and doing it. Just, yeah, just do do the like, sign language. Just, just like, like little whisper. Yeah, like the like, the, the sound of their like. like yeah. yeah, I like that. Like mm-hmm. I get, I, I get it. You supposed to be, like in real life. That's, that's how you do it. Mm-hmm. But in the movie, just you know, just make it. Oh, like feel natural. Yeah, yeah. 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 that might just be me. Might just no, no, no. I, to me, I agree. It, it feel it feel forced. It feel yeah, like, it feel like okay. She's 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 deaf, and now suddenly everybody everybody around the whole show no sign language like that. Mm-hmm. Like also, how in the world? Is she and and Hawkeye on the same like same or similar level, bro? Like she like combat wise. Yeah, yeah, like combat wise. How they on the same or similar level? Um, and did what she give? I don't think she gave me Yelena more for money, was she? I, if I if I remember correctly. Um, not really. I just Yelena watching everybody know so. <laughs> yeah, Yelena came on was just watching, bro. Um, I liked, I like the I like Yelena and um Kate's like interaction. You know, I like the interactions. Yeah. 
Um, I don't, I, I don't know Black Widow, so I, I don't know if she's yeah. goofy. I don't know if she's goofy in the movie. Yeah, but, she's not in the movie. In the movie. Uh, but oh, the 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 reveal wasn't as good as like wasn't as big as I think they thought it was gonna be. Yeah, because the movie didn't do that good, so I don't get why they expect that. Yeah, and, <gasps> yeah, like I, I wasn't gasping. Either. Oh, that's cool. I was more hyped King Ben than all the. Yeah, yeah, I was like, oh, that's that's cool, I guess. Um, or, but on on the negative side of them being like buddy buddy, if she's trying to kill your friend, why are you like goofing? See, that's not what the seriousness was. <laughs> Just a little bit, bro. Yeah, like, she, like she, she, I understand the one scene when they're at house department. Yeah. Okay, we joke yeah. around. Shit. Okay, just yeah. cause just us. Yeah. And it, but she even said, "You get my way again, I, um, keep so, Yeah. I'm gonna kill you, or whatever. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah. And it's like, bro, they got she got in your way. Press, press all the fucking buttons on the elevator. Yeah. That's you ain't do shit, bro. <laughs> I thought I thought it'd be an elevator fight. Yeah. Uh, I don't the Captain America scene. <laughs> yes, bro. I'm like, I'm like, bro, what's going on? Yeah. Like, y'all and, and, the, and like, I thought, okay. After everything, we can get serious. Mm-hmm. It was still jokes the whole time. Yeah. Like, it was literally jokes, 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 jokes. I'm like, like, bro, like, what is going on? Yeah. I do like that they didn't, like, try to power this girl up to make it, like, stand a chance against, uh, Yelena. Yeah. Yeah. But every time she tried to fight her, they pretty much, she pretty much kicked her ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, um, yeah, it, it was, I, I like the characters together. That was kind of cool to see them interact. I feel like they, they were kind of, like, similar-ish. Um... Towards the end, like last two episodes, it started to feel kind of rushed to me. Like, yeah, I was not expecting to have this episode. I thought it'd be yeah. like nine. Yeah, it, yeah. it, it seemed like it needed two more episodes, at least two. Yeah. Um, it seemed like okay, shit, that's Kingpin. Let's end this shit, you know. <laughs> and, like, and they built up towards Kingpin thing. They had the whole like intro, like outro, turned to the Kingpin. I was like, oh shit. So who's gonna be like a huge like huge part? Which is yeah, a decent part of it, but to me, they did him dirty, bro. They did him dirty. Um, let's talk about Kingpin, bro. That's that's too much elephant in the room. I think Nick was too strong. Yeah, he was too strong. I think Nick was too weak. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think I think he's in the minority, bro. He ripped the hinges off the door. <laughs> Cassis. Off not that nigga beheads nigga with doors. Cassis? That's different. He ripped it off the door and threw it. He tossed it. Cassis, you are still Cassis. Bro, go go back and be the do the first mission of Spider Man Cassis. Yeah, that's different. Nigga, he is tussling with Spider Man. Okay, he's Ma- tussling with Spider Man. Okay, and it's kind of wise. The comics. Okay, okay. They, they're gonna take the, same, take, take the same nigga from Daredevil, right? Yes. And everybody Daredevil is grounded. Or, you know, street level nigga. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah. And you put because you watch Daredevil now a little bit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You seen you seen Kingpin a little bit, right? A little bit, a little bit. Um, I saw him like beat up yet. Yeah. yeah. All right. And, 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 and how was he? Was he built different on there? Yeah, he's kind of he's he built a door there. Because he, 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 he ripped a door. He off built that today. nigga on there. Could he? Could he ripped a door for him today? A car door. Uh, it's not the same character though. It's the MCU. I get it. Everybody's showing okay. MCU. But it, also, it threw me off. It threw me off. It threw me off. I say that this nigga got hit by a car, bro. Nigga, nigga no, was taking you arrows, understand? Bro. He goes toe to toe with Spider Man. Spider Man is his enemy. Okay, I hope they explain it. The square circle, bro. Jump into the shit. I bet, buddy, he got shot with a bullet. That's it. Give me score soccer, bro. I, I, I give him to he um went to the whatever name the um, power broker and got powers from like um. He don't know fucking powers. He don't need no powers. That's not normal, bro. <laughs> that's not normal. That's <laughs> not. I'm telling you, bro. He is. See, you think see, people think people look at Kingpin and thinking that okay, the nigga's fat, nigga. He's not fat. See, it's muscle, nigga. It's literally muscle. But I'm saying, how is this man taking arrows, bro? He's bro, a, man, God. <laughs> that, that, that was a. Who was supposed to do? No, that was, they didn't. They didn't stop that. Yeah. Maybe it is. If, I, I, was, if, I was assume maybe it's okay. Him. If he took it off, if he took it off, like he's like, what do you think I was supposed to do? Like that would be one thing. Man just ripped the arrow out. <laughs> yeah, but it looked like it looked like it was like some black. I don't know. I don't know. Under his arm, bro. I see. Bro, nothing, I'm telling bro. you, man. I'm okay, telling you. why was you wearing that Hawaiian shirt, bro? Huh? Now he looked goofy, fuck. He, <laughs> he, he looked like he looked like the thing, bro. Was it when I had to? Yes. I don't know what he did. I don't know what. I don't know what he's trying to go for. I don't know. I'm glad um, they brought into the. I'm glad, I'm glad they brought the original actor yeah. back. Yeah. Um, Cause, cause, cause when you first seen him, bro, he had the eye twitch and like, you think you can just quit being part of the. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. He had, they had the, the chills that he gave you on the um, yep. Daredevil show. Yep. But then towards the end, he's like, like a like a little Disney villain, bro. He really was. Um, I feel like I feel like they hold him, bro. I'm sorry, bro. I, 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 like the whole fight, I was like, he's getting hold. He's getting hold. This nigga go toe toe with Daredevil. You, can, you can't take. You, you can't compare Daredevil to Kate Bishop. You think you think you think Kate Bishop is losing it? I mean, you think Daredevil losing to Kate Bishop? No, uh, not a chance. In, 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 so how the fuck Kate Bishop to Daredevil? I don't I mean, how I, Kate, I don't understand. I don't understand that, bro. It, it, it powers him down completely, bro. It really did. Like, like, cause, like cause I really wanted. I really had high, um, like high expectations from him. I thought he'd be like a like. 
He, I don't. Uh, he, he not gonna be no Thanos level. Um, yeah, threat. Mm-hmm. But he could have been like for the, all the little niggas, yeah. for all the Daredevils, the like maybe maybe Spider Man. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, you know. With some Black Melon and some like some other niggas on him. Mm-hmm. Like he could have been a real real menace. But now the fact that Kate was some freaking bling bling and getting him knocked out, bro. Like like bro, it was cool the way she killed. I mean the way she got him. They should they shouldn't let him fight. Huh? They should not let him fight. Yes. That's why I feel like if it was, it was Russ. And maybe maybe if it was Kate Bishop and Hawkeye who beat him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But Kate Bishop on her own? The rookie? First of all, fucking bet. Bro, I'm telling you. Go back and play the third mission on Spider-Man. I he is going, he is, <laughs> he is going toe-to-toe with Spider-Man. That, that is a better Spider-Man. That's not, that's not rookie Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. That is a bet Spider-Man. Mm-hmm. They told him, go through this. Boom. You played the game today. You know what it Bro, is. I, yeah, I'm just saying they boom, they threw boom. me off for keeping 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 it at the same. I, I appreciate it, but damn, bro, they threw me off, bro. He, he hit that's okay. The Daredevil Spider Man from Netflix. If he hit my car, he's not getting up like that, bro. <laughs> he's not just uh. he is. No, he's not. Wait, the Daredevil keeping. The Daredevil keeping getting yes, hit by he car. Yes, he is. He's not getting up. Yes, he is. No, he's not. Yes, he is. Yes, he is. How much you bet he, he spotted a bullet getting shot? Huh? In, 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 in the scene, him him get shot by shot by um Echo. I'm, 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 he ate that shit and spread it out. Bet money he did. Yeah, I'm betting those. You think they don't, they don't shot him and he ate that shit and spread it out? Shit. He, it, it, went, it went and got stuck, stuck, stuck in his jaw. Put that shit out. Threw it out of the ground. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga's different. <laughs> that nigga's different, bro. He, I get why he did it, bro. He's, he, he's, he he's, damn near, like, he's damn near like. Okay, I, I don't know. Look, look, look at that powers. Look at his yeah. powers. He's fucking trouble. Like, what, how do you get that power? Somebody like injected him or something. Oh. Well, well, maybe in MCU they were they were explaining. That he got, he got, he got I think he, but I'm, the only way you can do that because remember on the um, Captain America show, um, mm-hmm. that Sharon Carter was like giving people powers. Mm-hmm. Maybe that's what he did. Maybe he bought some. Maybe, bro. That's it. He got super soul. Super soul. I, I'm saying he hold the nigga. Hold it. Especially, especially if he did, if he did get some of the spirit serum, plus he's already kingpin. She's she's Captain America. That's he did. She's, be kind of my ass. Bro, like, you can literally go watch some of the old cartoons with Spider Man. Mm-hmm. He's giving Spider Man the fucking beats. I get that. I get that. And, and Spider Man, you can compare Spider Man to Kate Bishop. Mm-hmm. They didn't shit let him fight. They shit let him fight. They really shouldn't have. They should let him sit in the cooler. He should have been, been, been sitting in this chair watching shit go down. Yep. Sitting in the cooler. Like, okay, it's time to go. Yep. Get a helicopter. Dip. Get, get. May, maybe, maybe ended on, on, the, on, the, on the season. The season, even the season on um, Echo finding him. All right. Bro, he should have grabbed like on Thurford Bush, bro. Nick, I'm sure he will. I'm sure you got that bullet set. Push it back right in her face. She flew through the wall, bro. They fell off too. It is. It is me, bro. It's surprised me to see how strong he was. Like, it's not surprising. And then he, he's still lost. <laughs> yeah, the fact that he still lost was crazy. And bro, oh my god. Go go watch that scene. Go watch that scene when um Kate's mom pulls out. Like Kate was Kate's mom was was like behind him in a car. Two seconds later, <laughs> <laughs> I already thought somebody was pulled up. I already thought, I already thought somebody else like a new character introduced. No, don't do him the whole. No, stay down, walk away, bro. What the hell is that, bro? That, that old eight, eight, the freaking nineteen eighties cartoon. Freaking, no, I'm done with you. Now stay down. <laughs> like that was so corny, bro. That, I gotta say, a lot of the fight scenes were kind of corny under to me. Like, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, episode um four. The rooftop, the rooftop, the rooftop yeah. when um. Yeah, Yelena and Echo and Kate. It, it was a cool concept, mm-hmm. bro. That shit like Power Rangers, bro. That shit yeah. like choreography, dancing. They're like yeah. one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's it, bro. It looks so bad. Bro. Like, okay, why two niggas fighting? What, what third nigga doing? Watching? Yes, I I saw that. I saw that. <laughs> yeah. hey, when it's like they take turns. Yeah, like bro, when it's a real fight, you do anything, anything to win. Like you might not fight like like no more type shit, but mm-hmm. you you trying to get the dub, bro. You trying to win. Yeah. You trying to knock nigga out. Mm-hmm. And it just felt like they was like doing like, okay, I don't, I don't want to go too hard on you, bro. Yeah. Like, like that's what it felt like, bro. It felt like training. Definitely. Mm-hmm. Um, not okay, not just shit on Hawkeye, but because they had some good moments in the last episode at least. Um, the ice rink scene when um they uh oh yeah, Kate and Hawkeye was the yeah around it. I think they finally started killing niggas, bro. I don't know. To, in my heart, I gotta say they killed niggas, bro. Cause if they shot on arrows, nobody died, nobody dropped. They killed niggas, bro. They shot. I, I, I think they're not concerned. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think I'm not the person going to kill headshots like trying to kill Yeah, yeah. The, the I like the spike arrows. Um, I like the freaking uh, with the cushion and shit. Yeah, the the, uh, the Ant Man arrow. Oh uh, yeah. 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 Do we see him use use stock arrow? Or he didn't use it. I'm not, I don't know. I can't tell. There's too much yeah. shit going on. But it, that was cool. I, I like the whole like the magnet thing. It was cool. Um, I'm. 
I'm pretty sure he's gonna get us another season. Yeah. I don't know if that nigga gonna be Hawkeye anymore. Huh? <laughs> I don't know if that nigga gonna be Hawkeye either, bro. Why? Jim Renner? What happened? Like it's in his eyes, bro. I mean, like, I think, like, like that. I don't know, bro. <laughs> and, like, and, like I, I see him on, I see him on uh, Instagram. He, he, like, he's, like, supporting it and shit. Like, yeah. like, 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 comments talking shit. Like, like, or, like, when, um, what's his name? Chris, not Chris Evans. What's the nigga's play? Chris Hemsworth. He, his son is using bowls now, and he like he talking shit. Uh, <laughs> so like it's like he's still like in a role, you know. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. I, I, I see him still having mental, all right. You know, I, I like him now because I heard I didn't like him in Hawkeye because mm-hmm. I, I was so used to like seeing like the Avengers cartoon with him like the, yeah. the little beaks and shit. Yeah. Um, but now he, he going on me. Um, which rate show at one out of ten? One out of ten. I, I I'm going after him never. Uh, it started out strong. Like if it started, if it kept the same feeling as it did from mm-hmm. episode one to episode six, it'd probably be like an eight, nine. Yeah. Um, but right now I give it a seven. Yeah, I give it a seven as well. I give it a seven, maybe maybe a six and a half. I'll give it an eight. Eight. Yeah. Um, I don't know, man. Uh, if I had to give it, a, if I had to rank the Disney Plus show, we gotta do it every year. I mean, every time a show drops, we gotta gotta um rank the Disney Plus shows. Ugh. Um, is it better than WandaVision? No. 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 Is it better than Loki? No. no. Loki, better. Look at the best. Love it better than Captain America. I watched it. <clears throat> I don't know. I say no. I, I think the freaking yeah, yeah. I feel like I feel like and I feel like that did more for MCU. Maybe it puts MCU more more for than the Hawkeye did. I guess so. Cause now we got a new Captain. Oh no, who is going to? But I mean, the new Captain America. I, I think. I, and, okay, so I'm, I'm I'm gonna give him a list, bro. That's um, I think it's better than um. I think the best show still One Division. Second best, Loki. I was giving Loki. I might give it to um, Cat America, bro. I was saying that. I was saying I like it. Y'all niggas was sleeping on that shit, yeah. bro. Y'all niggas was sleeping on that shit. Because when, when, um, what's the dude's name? The the, the, the fake Cat America. Uh-huh. When he freaking cut that nigga's head off, bro. I was like, oh shit, this shit different. This shit different, bro. You gotta watch it. Bro. Uh, you gotta watch it, bro. Uh, you gotta watch it. Bro. Uh, you gotta watch it bro. Um, number three. Number three. Which one was better? Oh, look, we got Loki. Yeah, number three, I get Loki. You put Loki number three? Uh, uh right after um, I think Loki big in there every time it dropped. Yeah, but I don't know. I, I think I rewatched the Captain America one before we watched Loki. Um, I'm not a big Owen Wilson fan, bro. Hmm? I'm not a big Owen Wilson fan. Everything is. Oh, <laughs> yeah, it is. Um, you want? I mean, you can see, you want, I mean, he was kind of high. Number four. I think Hawkeye's a little better than Winter, to be honest. I like I didn't though, but that's, uh, not, that's not a good thing. Yeah. What, what if, what if Wade, the series, the series mutant What If need to turn way up? That's, 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 yeah. that's all I'm mm-hmm. from. I don't like how it's like different shit every episode, wasn't it? Oh, yeah. Uh, they kind of, they kind of tied together at the end. Oh, it does? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Well, I like to watch it then. Yeah. Um, my list real quick. Uh, number one, give it low-key. Um, Niggas, niggas gas at one of too much, bro. You're not gonna fucking stick it right there. Um, <laughs> one division had three week episodes. We gonna forget about that. Mm-hmm. One division had like three week episodes. Well, they dropped it all at once, bro. They, 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 they dropped it all at once, bro. I don't give a damn. That don't, they, mean, they, they, don't, they, don't they, make the content even better. They knew. No, they, they, it's like it's like going like out of the way. First three episodes, first. Yeah, three yeah episodes. oh, they were weak as shit. Yeah. The first, one, first episode one, born mm-hmm. as fuck. Episode two yeah. got a little better. Yeah, it, 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 I think one of them just had good cliffhangers. It's yeah. not good. We're not gonna not good. We we pay little bit. The last episode was fire. Yeah, mm-hmm. fire. Um, but that's about it. So Loki, Loki episodes. Were, Maybe because it created the itch we're missing. You know. Yeah, because we haven't had any good MCU shit. Yeah, can, can, mm-hmm. when I went from black and white to like the the end game cameras. Yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. shit. I think that made made us what it was. But yeah. it, I said like it had the quick civil little tease type thing. Yeah, 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 yeah. I definitely, I definitely give it a number two mm-hmm. in this spot. But Loki, one was number two. Um, I'm gonna give Captain America number three. Mm-hmm. Um, then number four, I give it to Hawkeye. Okay. Okay. Fair enough. Well, Funny, bro. Niggas sleeping. Niggas, niggas was sleeping. On, niggas have so much shit on the Captain Falcon. Cause I, looking at it, you're like, who the fuck gonna watch that? Mm-hmm. Cause I said the same thing. But like, I'm, like, I'm going to watch it. Put that shit on. I watch it one day, bro. This is fire. Yeah, they, they killed niggas episode one, bro. Right. This is fire. Yeah. Oh, right. go ahead, sir. Go ahead. Oh uh, well, I'm going to make our list. Uh, yes, yeah, we give the Loki, mm-hmm. one division, one division. Uh, then I'll give it to. What else? What else? What else? 
I mean, yeah, man, what is Cat doing there? Yeah, uh, that's like up there. Uh, so you got Hawkeye or what if? I'll go ahead and give it to Hawkeye. And then what if? You watch the Eternals yet? Like, I'm waiting to come out. It's come out. Uh, no, it's not Xbox Plus yet? No, it's not Xbox Plus yet. Come, come, come out next month. I think next week, actually. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm watching YouTube. Um, but yeah, I think. If, the, if, the, if this is if this is where the new MC is going, how you feeling? Um, like, you think it's going to outdo the Avengers? If it's building like with Shang Chi's, the Eternals. I've not watched Shang Chi. Um, That's on this post. Shang Chi is fire. Yeah, Shang Chi. Uh, Shang Chi, uh, the ha- Hawkeye, Kate Bishop, um, y- y- Yaletta, Yaletta, um, who else yeah. we got coming? They got the uh, Monica Rambeau. Everybody forget about her. Who? Um, the girl from the black girl, the black lady from um. From one division, she got power time. Oh yeah, her um, uh, Scarlet, Duck Strange. I'm waiting for. Oh, I, I heard, I heard show is gonna be fire, bro. Right. Um, she's like this girl who goes like um to one Iron Man school and she like makes her own suit. And in and, and the combo, it's like it's like an AI trying to start talking to her, but I don't think mm-hmm. do that. It might be Pepper or something. Uh, she's she uh, like a division next Iron Man. Um. I don't know. I, 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 do you, do you think you're on a pace to go, to go stronger than the next Avengers? I mean, the last Avengers, or do you think all of them just took on a deal? Mm, not as far man I did. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> I, I think, it, it, I mean, it'd be decent, but I it, it, think it'd still be leaving you, like, um, one more, you know? It's still, it, it'd be like, dang, he's not the OGs, bro. Like, dang. Like, it'd be like one of the old memes, like, oh, like, dang, look at us now. Like, yeah, which I grew up on. We yeah. Up on that shit. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. it's going to be, you know, they're going to, Insert, insert. Already doing it now. Insert little, do like woke man shit and like, which, which I, I could already a little bit of, but you know, it's gonna, it's gonna be that. It's gonna be that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's gonna be like what they think. Okay, well, I know. I'm gonna be in the podcast, but yeah. what? Give, give me like a good like a handful of characters they think that can save the map in there. Uh, Spider Man. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um. Uh, a, a non fat Thor. Okay. Uh, Hulk being Hulk again. Uh, I doubt they bring Captain America back, but they need a leader. No, no, no. I'm in a new character. Like, oh, new characters? Like, well, you, well, you, you can, you can get a Thor in them. But. Okay, a new character. Um, because I'm talking about like, because this is kind of, I'm like new Avengers right now. Yeah. yeah. <sighs> Maybe Fan of Thor. Yeah, I'm thinking that Fan of Thor Avengers type shit. Yeah. yeah. I mean, uh, S-Men type shit. I think, yeah. I know they're part of that too. Yeah, not yet. They but they are Marvel. Yeah, they're Marvel. Oh, not, yeah. not part of MCU. Yeah. Hopefully, in, no spoiler. Spoiler. Well, no, it's not in touch. But mm-hmm. hopefully, it's like with the um, multiverse. Yeah, make it. Yeah, they'll get teased. Mm-hmm. Now, if they do some big shit with that, the people, people, people already. I'm not. I'm not gonna make it happen. My, my hopes. They're so already not. doing the Spider-Man treatment, bro. And I don't think they gotta. They gotta keep in mind the niggas who made it, Spider-Man. It's not saying niggas who made um, um, Dr. Strange. Actually, I think it might be Sam Raimi. Yeah, Sam Raimi. I don't think he listens to that nigga dick way too much. I don't think he listens to y'all niggas, bro. I don't think he gonna freaking, um, oh shit, they want this? Oh, they want that? Yeah, it's like, it's oh, like, they want this? It's like, is Sam Raimi gonna be like, like the next Marvel nigga? Is he gonna be Marvel's mother? Or is he gonna go on and done that thing? I think. Uh, if it was one done, then he gonna, he gonna give a fuck about that universe. I think it's, yeah, depending on how many make. But, I, I know, but I think it, I think it's both. Like, if, if he's, if he's only getting paid to do a one and done, mm-hmm. why would you care about the future of the, uh, well, I think, I think Marvel gives you like a lot of like wiggle room, but they still give you the sandbox, bro. Like you need to make sure this happens, this happens, this happens. But you can do it. I don't matter how you get there, but make sure this happens. Oh, okay, okay. I think like, that's, I think like the works. like the little last event. Yeah. yeah. Um. But uh, I said fantastic. Marvel, like the time people shit. Yeah. <laughs> um, I do wonder, like, um, cause the niggas are already giving the Spider-Man treatment for 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 Doctor Strange too. They they're saying like um, dang when um. When the OB rushes, when OB rushes, cap uh, hop out the portal, and then when um when Chris Evans walk out, does it think cap? He says cap. He goes fling on, cause you know he used to be um he used to be on the Oh, it's like this is that nigga's home for it, but I'm, I don't think we get that, bro. Cap's not coming back. I'm sorry. No, I'm no, they saying like he might come back as um just for a cameo as like uh, Human Torch. Like the niggas might think he's Captain America, but he's fucking Human Torch. I know. Wait, oh, I thought you did, they not. I didn't the. Like no. they're making the big. What the fuck? They, who thinks? I don't. I never, I never thought of them bringing back the old. No, I mean, just like for cameo shit. Like, oh. like not, not to actually bring them back. Just to tease that they're coming back. Like the fans will come back. 
like trying to do like the Star Soldier thing with like Spider Man did. I don't think. No, I'm saying I don't. I, I would never think that old cast of Fantastic Four like this guy album, this guy album and shit. Man, me either, me either, me either. They're not coming to MCU. What the fuck? Yeah. I just I would see like a new Reed Richards or a new Human Torch, a new thing. I just uh, one that I do have. I do kind of have like, mm-hmm. higher hopes for Doctor Strange. Um, I think I might see it in the theaters. I don't know why. Yeah, 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 definitely, definitely. Um, cause I didn't see the first Doctor Strange in theaters, but I watched it on like. Like, I think Redbox a couple years ago. Yeah, it's good. It's a good movie. I still watched it. Yeah, I need good movie. It. Good movie. Um, yeah, I, I gotta see it, bro. But I think Dust Train is on. Yeah, it is. If thing comes back, bro, snatch that shit from Hulk. Snatch that shit from Hulk. Dang, snatch that shit dang, from Hulk. Dang, bro. You, you, Hulk gotta be back, bro. He gotta be back. He's gotta, if, if thing is coming back and you do him right, snatch that shit. I don't think Hulk. they're gonna. I don't think they're gonna bring Hulk if, if, if first they give him like nasty thing, not like a freaking human cover rocks, like a nasty big looking thing, bro. Yes. Paw, paw, whoa, paw. I am paw, 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 paw. this, bro. Alright, man. Um, thank, thank y'all for watching this podcast or listening. Um, we also have a YouTube channel, Struggle Studio. We have the game channel, Struggle Studio Gaming. Uh, our Twitter is Studio Struggle. And our Instagram is Struggle Studio underscore. We are on all streaming platforms. Spotify, Apple Podcasts. We should write us five stars. Um, leave a comment. Um, telling us some not topics we can have for the next show. Uh, yeah, anything else? Um, I think I got it wrong. Yes, sir, yes, sir, yes, sir. Thank you for watching. We out. Peace. Peace. <laughs> uh.